Big Sandy Healthcare held its ribbon cutting and open house for their new women's mobile health clinic Wednesday, May 1st. The clinic will serve women of all ages throughout eastern Kentucky and help eliminate barriers to health care. Well, here in rural Appalachia, you know, one of the barriers to health care is obviously transportation. Whether it be um, physical transportation, not having a vehicle, or, you know, the financial aspect of it. Um, so it's very important that, you know, if we want to give these patients good uh, quality health care, that we provide the basics. And, of course, um, access to the clinic, uh, the mobile clinic, is, is great because we, we go to them. They don't have to make arrangements for a car maybe a babysitter. They don't have to worry about whether they have gas money to get to the clinic. So we go directly to them and I think that's really going to help our patients take away one less worry and also provide them uh, just easy access to get great health care. Appalachian Wireless, where your connections matter the most. Right now, get up to $550 off select devices on new or renewed line with the Appalachian Unlimited or Mix and Mash plan. Offer good in-store only. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. The clinic will provide a range of care, including pregnancy confirmation, ultrasounds, lab work, fetal monitoring, postpartum care, and general gynecological care. The Women's Health Mobile Unit is providing services uh, to the women of Appalachia uh, with obstetric and gynecologic care, um, really the entirety of the spectrum from adolescence through geriatric care. As we all know, women tend to ignore their own care um, to take care of their families. Uh, we would like to make the possibility for them to receive care more accessible to them. Um, the importance of women's health care is, is definitely something that's been um, on the back burner, um, but we are hoping to bring it to the forefront with um, cancer screenings, prenatal care, um, and just general women's health wellness. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.